So guys, watch this video to find out how a simple water bottle can help you get more weight transfer and more compression at impact. Do you look like a bit of compression through impact or don't get the correct weight shift or find yourself losing balance in the follow through? A lot of this can be attributed to how your right foot is moving in that downswing, okay? So we have a really simple drill that's gonna help you with this. But first of all, explain what the drill is gonna be about for you. Okay, so first of all, I see a lot of players struggle with the right foot and it moves away from the target like this. So it's spinning away and you can see there how if I drop the club down here, the, the heel is further away from the target than where it was at address, okay? So this is, means that my weight has gone backwards and that to get any compression of Shaffley and impact is gonna be incredibly difficult because to get Shaffley, I've gotta be over my left side in this manner, okay? And if I've hit it from here, probably started to scoop the ball a little, which is gonna make it super inconsistent. We'll be able to see from here, you don't want this movement. You look at all the great ball strikers out there. You look at your Jordan Spieth with the footwork, the Tiger Woods, Rory McIlroy, the guys on tour who are playing some incredible golf, all have this right foot moving in this direction, which from the front means it's going this way. It isn't going this way, okay? So what else is gonna cause is if you've got this happening, you're gonna be further away from the ball your low point control, where you strike the background, will alter. You'll mean that you could be hitting it backwards, so hitting behind the ball, or thinning it, hitting it a little bit more on the up as you're trying to reach for the golf ball because you're too far away from it. The other thing it can be is that it's costing you massive amounts of distance because you're not able to get over that front foot, okay? So the roll of that right foot and how it moves, how it rolls in, not moving out, is going to be vital to this. So water bottle simplest drill going great for feedback the reason i want it when i look at a drill i'm always looking at it if you do it incorrectly it has to give you the feedback so you can then self-evaluate and make the necessary swing changes for your game so what i do is i've got this right next to my right foot here and i'll be looking at hitting golf balls okay and if i make the movement through i'm moving away from the ball so you can see right knee's moving in right foot's never touched the bottle okay if i make the wrong move Feedback is going to be, knocked it over, it's gone back. I now know that I didn't make the movement I needed to do. So it's the simplest drill going because instant feedback. Did I miss it? I must have made the right movement because right next to the foot. And if I hit it, I must have made the incorrect movement. That's the key to any practicing you set up to help you with your game. It's got to give you the feedback if it's incorrect or correct. And this is ideal. This is going to help you with compression. It's going to help you with weight shift and being able to control the golf ball via club face control. So guys, if you enjoyed this video and there's more drills you'd like to see, comment below what drills do you like to see or what areas in your game you're struggling with. We can have a look at some drills that maybe help you with your game. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do so. Thanks for watching and talk with you again very soon.